All right, ready? Ready! Yeah. You, you, you with an S, 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 S with an A, you with an S, S with an A, U, S, A! <laughs> Hi, everybody! Hi! It's hot. We're coming to you with our patriotic Olympic edition. We We're ready. We've been enjoying TV, and I say that coming from someone who doesn't watch TV hardly anymore. Right. It's a big thing. Mm -hmm. It's a big thing. We're so, enjoying the Olympics. Hope yeah. you are too. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so we've got our patriotic going on. Yep. And I was going to share, I was actually at the 1984 Olympics in Los Angeles as a spectator. <laughs> Let's just be clear. <laughs> Had a great time, but uh, I, I enjoy both summer and winter games, mm -hmm. and we've really had a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. So, and then my necklace was given to me by my grandmother um, quite a number of years ago. So every chance I get, I like wearing it, and I think of her. <laughs> So it's good. You bet. So we feel like we need to pick up where we left off last time because okay. we were suddenly cut off. Ready? So here we go. <laughs> Remember this? <laughs> this is our cool holly fabric. Yeah. <laughs> we think it's pretty cool. So there it is it again. Yes, it's really nice. Yeah. And this is from the Cindy Cindy Sorley has a website, a Facebook group, and um, this is Ada, mm -hmm. and the design is printed. And we are really looking forward to uh, finding some designs to do some ornaments on this. Yep. But it's very nice. It's fun. Yep. It's a lot of fun. Thank you, Cindy Sorley. And then. Oh. <laughs> Get ready. Okay. All right. And. Thank you, Melly. <laughs> We got our thank buttons. You. Here oh, we are. This was our like so much. piece that got cut off last time. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Millie Ellie Stitches, for these cute, it, cutie patootie buttons. Mm -hmm. We're so grateful and that you included Anita. That was super sweet. So thank it you. It was a very nice surprise. Yes. Very nice. And we enjoyed your sweet note. Yeah. So thank you. Um, Sorry, Air. The last time movie. we taped, we were talking about a get together that we were planning at Fiberworks in Waverly. And uh, the snow didn't slow us down. We win. We win. <laughs> we had so much fun. So we got to meet um, new Stitchy friends. Mm -hmm. Kate, um, from, if you've heard of Cowgirl Kate, Paints a Plenty on Instagram. And she is also a fantastic designer on Etsy, um, Eye of the Magpie. So go check out her design. She has a fantastic new farm design out. Um, and it's beautiful. It is beautiful. It's, it's so pretty. She's very talented. Mm -hmm. So go check her out and give her some love. And she's got a, a floss tube as well. Mm -hmm. And then we met um, Deb from Cedar Rapids. And she's on Instagram as Needle and Spoons. Mm -hmm. And what a sweetheart and a very talented stitcher. Uh, wow. We had, yeah, her glory walk. <sighs> amazing. Amazing. <laughs> Just the amazing stitchery that she has done. Just, yeah, I walked away thinking I need to pick up my game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Definitely, but yes. it was a great day. It was so much fun. We went out to eat and... Uh, Ate I, at this cute, kitschy little place called the Wild Carrot, yeah. which Anita had been to before and I hadn't. It was mm -hmm. a lot of fun. It was fun. Great food and lots of laughter, as you can imagine. Mm -hmm. Just, Just a great time. It was. We wish you all time. could have been there with us. So mm -hmm. maybe next time we can get next some time. more friends to join in. <laughs> yeah. It was awesome. It was awesome. Thanks, girls, for coming to meet us and spending time with us. So what are you want to share? Oh, what I'm all into. What I, she's all into. <laughs> what she's all into. Um, just a couple of things to show today. Um, the first one is, I, I wanted to mention this earlier in January and I forgot to. So I really love Orange Circle Studio planners. I just think they're, look at this, gorgeous. The colors are amazing. Um, and I usually find these at TJ Maxx. That's my place, mm -hmm. my go-to place to find these. Love them so much. And the inside is just as colorful. So there's always these gorgeous like pages with sayings and 
um, you'll get a f this particular style. They have different styles, but this one has a full month and that it will also have um, like daily pages like this, which mm -hmm. I know mine looks kind of bare. I'm and as, as teachers, my... we're all about planners. <laughs> <laughs> so I just wanted to share this. If it you're is... looking for a fun planner, Orange mm -hmm. Circle Studio, amazing planners mm -hmm. and just super. I love color. I'm very mm -hmm. attracted to color. So super gorgeous. Yeah, I keep one next to me when I'm watching Floss Tube. Keep notes. Yeah, it's which is, nice. I need to be better about doing that. So I'm learning from Anita as usual. <laughs> she, she teaches me things. <laughs> And then the next thing that I'm all into, mm -hmm. um, I, I am a Christian, so um, I don't mean to offend anyone by sharing this book. It is a Christian book. Um, it's a book that my husband and I are reading for a Sunday school class that we go to before in the morning at church. Um, it's called Parenting 14 Gospel Principles That Can Radically Change Your Family by Paul David Tripp. And it is mm -hmm. a fantastic book. And it spurred on a lot of conversation and discussion um, with the people in our group. Um, so it's really worth your time to read. Um, I think we all we all can stand to improve in our parenting. And for me, reading this book, I've just been really self-reflective mm -hmm. um, about what I need to change in me. I think so So often as parents, we want to try and change the things that we see in our kids that are negatives. Um, and this is really, for me, it's more about mm -hmm. what can I change in me and let go and give to God to change in my child's heart. So if that interests you, go check out this book. It's well worth your time. So those are my all into's. <laughs> what am I into? Well, it appears putting some receipts in my receipt jar. <laughs> I've got to say, I might need to get a bigger jar. <laughs> That's why I don't have a jar. I don't want it to be staring me in the face, making me feel guilty. Oh, it's, it's an eye opener. It's a <laughs> It's, it's fun though. So <laughs> it has been fun. <laughs> I've jumped yeah. on the bandwagon of yeah. stitchy no shopping. Stitch, yeah. No stitching from stash here. <laughs> Just not this year. <laughs> Whatever budget I would have had, I've already blown it. So <laughs> I'll try again next year. <laughs> And we still have plans for more shopping, <laughs> much to our husband's oh, chagrin. They're supportive well, of our stitching, but... Well, and the <laughs> announcement from uh, Lizzie Kate, you know, um, right. Lizzie Kate closing and, and just, I don't know. I know, that was a big bummer. We love her. We love her designs, and I know everybody's kind of been in a panic about right. the accessibility of her patterns, so... So are we. Yeah. <laughs> Right. <laughs> so we did a little Lizzie shopping recently. <laughs> we have. We have. Um, oh, your mug? Oh. Today's mug. Oh, yep. I will always love you. This was given to me by one of my students a couple years ago um, around Valentine's time. So, right. yeah. We know, we know Valentine's is past, but we thought hey. we'd share anyway. Yeah, we'd bring on the love. So... <laughs> So guac may be extra, but my love is free. <laughs> I love that. Yeah. <laughs> I love guac too. <laughs> but I yeah. love that mug. <laughs> Way to go, Amber. <laughs> love it. So that was good. So we'll go right into whips. Mm -hmm. And we're both working on an Olympic project. Um, Union Forever. Here it is. It's a Blackbird design, mm -hmm. um, Maggie Bononomi right. um, so, artwork. And we're really enjoying the, the stitch. It's fun. It is. It's nice. So, well, there we go. And, yep. So, we, I don't know. Hopefully, I don't know, the Olympics are over, what, another week? I think another week. Yeah. I don't know. Need, need another snow day. <laughs> <laughs> we kind of do. <laughs> and my, um, my needle minder is by Designs by Lisa. You can find her on Etsy. And it's, I think it's a, it's a scrabble tile. Uh-huh. And just, I really enjoy them. Cowboy up. 
Yeehaw. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And the colors that I'm using, I am between mm. two colors. Oh, um, yeah. We did some, we've done a little color conversion. Barn door and ruby slipper. I'm kind of going back and forth with the red. Mm -hmm. And then the blue I am using, I don't know, I found in my stash. I think something's wrong here because the color is shamrock. <laughs> What? Okay. <laughs> what? Oh, what? We kind of thought that was a green I... color, so uh, okay. something's off. So the color I'm using is shamrock. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe not. <laughs> and I'm using ruby slipper for my red. And then for the blue, I chose um, freedom, which is a oh, yeah. gentle it's art. It's a nice deep blue. Yeah, it's really pretty. It so. is really pretty. So, and then the next uh, whip I have is the Beach Cottage by Country Cottage Needleworks. And I have gotten through the alphabet. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> so, <laughs> I just have a little bit more at the bottom and the sand, a couple flowers, and it'll be done. So, so I really like it. Mm -hmm. I really, really like it. It's sweet. So, and that's part of a stitch along that ends at the end of the month. So, I think I'm going to hit the target for that one. Hot dog. And then I'm not bringing it here anymore, but I'm working on my daughter's wedding sampler as well. Mm -hmm. So, I'll show that once it's done and framed and after she's seen it. <laughs> yeah. So. I have been working on Forest Snowfall. Mm -hmm like crazy. I'm so excited. Mm -hmm. My little house is done. Mm -hmm. Yay. And I've started my deer. Super cute. I love this. It's been really fun to stitch. Oh, and I've got my tree trunks too. And they <laughs> need some leaves. <laughs> so I'm getting really close to finishing. Yeah. I'm excited about that. But the, the house turned out really cute. Oh, I should say too, I know a lot of people were complaining about the color um, that we were sent for the roof and the front door and that brown color was more mm. of kind of a pinky hue and I agreed with that. So I, um, mine was as well. So I picked walnut, which mm -hmm. is a general art color and I, it's beautiful. I really like how it's turning out. So yeah, I almost walnut. think that's what I used on this house. I'm not sure. Yeah. I have to look it up. Um, and that's oh. about and my journey piece. Oh. I forgot. I have barely... <laughs> Here I said, I'm going to start February and I'm not going to be able to put it down. Um, I've done a tiny little bit of February, as you can see right here. Here's my tiny little bit of progress because mm -hmm. I've been going crazy on Forest Snowfall and couldn't mm -hmm. put that down. So you can just see just a teeny tiny bit, but mm -hmm. it's a start, so Funny. I'll get back to it. I think it's the issue that I'm having is I'm a seasonal stitcher, I think. So like February rolls around, I'm like, oh. <gasps> I should have all these really cute Valentine stuff done. And I only want to start those projects like in February. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I need to move my timeline up. So like working on this patriotic piece for the Olympics is going to be great because that will be able to be up in July. Mm -hmm. But for the most part, anything I work on, pretty much you're going to have to wait a year to see it. <laughs> because <laughs> In your house. Yeah. You know, I just do it. That's why I'm excited about doing our ornaments for Stitch Mania right. because we'll be getting a head start. So we're mm -hmm. trying to teach ourselves to take a head start on things that are coming up rather mm -hmm. than, you know, you get in the mood to do Christmas stuff during the Christmas season. So right. trying to back that up so that mm -hmm. we're, yeah, hitting our seasons a little more appropriately. Mm -hmm. And then I have a finish. Yay. It's not an FFO because I don't think I do those. This is super cute. But um, you'll see it's a rooster um, from one of the British magazines. Uh, my daughter is using it right now, so I'd have to look it up later. But uh, this is for an exchange that we'll be participating in in May. Yeah. So Love those colors. Aren't <laughs> they fun? It was fun. It was yeah. a lot of fun. And it was so different than anything I'm working on right now. So... I really enjoyed it. And a quick stitch. Mm-hmm. Wow. <laughs> okay, maybe not. <laughs> All right. <laughs> that was a theory. But um, 
What else has gone on? Well, we've had conferences this past week. And so for us, right. that means that we work really late hours in preparation for conferences. And then a week we work before. a week before. And then we work really late hours for conferences. So oh, our school weeks. day on Tuesday um, of conference week is from 8.15 in the morning until 8 o'clock at night, 7.30 mm -hmm. at night. And then Thursday from 8.30 in the morning until 8 o'clock at night. So long days. We're super tired mm -hmm. usually. But the great thing about those long hours is then we have Friday off. So oh. we had this best Friday off. So spur of the moment. We got in the car. <laughs> we were driving. And Anita said, Osage, <laughs> which is a town about 50 minutes from here. And I said, sure. <laughs> <laughs> and so I said, just tell me where to go. What, and Just, I, just we, under an hour. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And we drove. <laughs> so I'm, of course, chattered the whole way there. Mm -hmm. So yeah. much fun. Oh my. We spent and the whole day there. At one point, my husband asked, are you still in the state of <laughs> Iowa? Like, where <laughs> are you guys? Because <laughs> it was like, you know. 7.30 p.m. I think when we came home, we left at about noon, mm -hmm. around noon. We are really lucky. We have numerous shops here in Iowa. Mm -hmm. And so we made it all the way to Osage to the Stitchery Nook. And there's the brochure. They also have a retreat center there. And we just had a blast. We did. We had so much fun. We loved meeting Sherry and Liz, mm -hmm. and um, just, it was delightful to visit with them. Um, they showed us their retreat center area, which is, right. it's huge, what? and it's beautiful. It's 4,000 square feet. About 4,000 square feet. Right. Incredible. Mm -hmm. All above their shop, and they've done a lot of work to make it... Just a very mm -hmm. inviting space. Yep. And they, they just now are putting in a lift, an yeah. elevator. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, that was exciting. Mm -hmm. That was exciting. We'd never been there before. Yeah. We, at one point, we had to take a break. <laughs> <laughs> we went and ate. We came back. <laughs> and fantastic food, too. It's like two doors, three doors down. Right. And some fabulous food at Tell You What. And at one and point, came I, back. I was joking. I'm like, there are beds upstairs. <laughs> We loved it that much. <laughs> we, we did. We had fun. Yes. It was a blast. So, the store um, was beautiful. It was so organized. Um, they had a lot to offer there. Mm -hmm. So it was a delight. So mm -hmm. if you get a chance and you're in Iowa, try, make the drive to Osage make and go the to the drive. Stitchery Nook. Mm -hmm. Say hi to Sherry and Liz. So, They're awesome. They were. Mm -hmm. They were really. So yeah, it was a great way to spend a day off. Yeah. Yep. It was, and it was a spur of the mm -hmm. moment, so we have to apologize to our friends, yes, Kate and Deb, because it wasn't planned. Right. If it had been planned, we would have said, hey, girls, want to meet us in Osage? But, yeah, no. it was like we're in the car, and all of a sudden it's like, oh, let's go to Osage. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so total spur of the moment, mm -hmm. but next time, ladies. We'll, we'll plan it. We'll plan it we so plan we can it. meet you there. <laughs> it was fun. So in we the Can't meet, wait to go back. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well. <laughs> in fact, Anita... <laughs> Saturday morning, she texted me, Osage? <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, oh my goodness, you know I get in the car in a second. <sighs> our husbands wouldn't be too happy because we kind of spent our wad on Friday. <laughs> Receipt jar. That's what I meant to. <laughs> I, I spent more. I spent more. Yeah. How, yeah. Yeah. So, oh. leading, which kind of leads us into our haul. Right. And we, we've, we've, this is a couple of visits worth of well, home. Yeah. Let's show our Stitchery in a call first. Should we do that? I could. <laughs> oh, sorry. You might Here, you start. Okay, I'll start. I will. So I went a little crazy with okay. fabric. <laughs> so I have this huge pile of pretty fabric. Just awesome. So oh. that was fun and fabulous. I needed to do it. <laughs> <laughs> it was super fun. So got that. And then, of course, just like everybody else, we were mm -hmm. interested in looking for some Lizzie Kate patterns. Right. Um, Anita and I, we super duper love cardinals. It's just kind of a, mm -hmm. a love of ours, our favorite bird. And so I'd had my eyes on this 
fa la 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 with the the cardinal, one of the jingles. That's amazing. I picked that up. I thought it was mm -hmm. so cute. And then also, yeah. oh, this was hard. It was a toss-up between this one and another one, which I need to go back and get the second one that I loved. But this one had the cardinal. Right. <laughs> Joy to the world. Love Isn't it. Beautiful? Isn't it pretty? Here, I'll get a little closer. Sorry for the glare. So, yeah. I oh, love that so much. Mm -hmm. So, it was very exciting. Of course, it comes with the fabric and the little um, button. So, mm -hmm. super fun. So, those are my... Nice. Oh. And then... We could show this one at the oh, same yeah, we time. Could. We are totally in love with this one. <gasps> we need to start stitching this, this now so, so we can put it out fun. for summer. Isn't oh, yeah. it fun? This what's it called? Red, white, and beach. See, I wouldn't even think that. We've got snow on the ground. I wouldn't even think that. Right. See, seasonal stitcher. I'd right. wait till I had my feet in the sand <laughs> and then I'd say, wait a minute, there's something I should be working on. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, the red, white, and beach. Which look, red, white, and beach. It goes yeah, with our theme true, for today. True. So mm -hmm. excited to pick that one up. That was nice. And then um, oh. I've been wanting this one for a long time. This is um, our story by Brenda Gervais. I love this one. In fact, I think that I saw. Mm -hmm. I think when I first saw this being stitched, I really, I think it was Karen Torres from um, So Much to Love. Mm -hmm. Um, we love her project bags so much. So mm -hmm. huge shout out to Karen. Definitely. She's awesome. Um, but I saw her stitching this and I was like, oh, I must have that. So I was kind of on the hunt mm -hmm. to find it and see who it was. And I noticed that she had tagged Brenda Gervais. Um, so I have wanted it for a long time and they had it. So I had to grab mm -hmm. it. And then mm -hmm. I have just become a huge um, Prairie Schooler mm -hmm. fan watching all of you sharing your projects and your pretties. So... Um, the Scissory Nook had some Prairie Schooler and I got really excited. So um, these are some that I've been wanting. This one's called Christmas Day, which I love. These are, they're all Christmas. I have so much Christmas. I will never be able to stitch it in my lifetime and my walls will be so covered. <laughs> Floor to ceiling. This is good Saint Nick. Well, we, keep, we keep the spirit of Christmas in our heart. <laughs> All year. Yes, we do. I'm particularly <laughs> drawn to Good St. Nick because this reminds me of when I was a kid and um, Christmas Eve, we would go visit our grandparents on Christmas Eve. And then uh, driving home, we lived clear out in the country and it was a drive. And so our family would sing Christmas carols on the way home. And we always sang up on the, up, uh, on the housetop. Mm -hmm. Rain, up on the housetop, reindeer paws. And my dad, <laughs> like, bless his sweetheart, not an amazing singer, drifts in and out of tune but would he sing with pizzazz on this song my mom has a beautiful voice he would sing with such pizzazz and we were all into it click 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 you know and just the whole <laughs> and so this just makes me think of my family yeah. and that memory and so I love that yeah you needed that one yeah and then this one I've had my eye on and have been wanting this for a long time so Christmas Eve mm -hmm. oh that is just heavenly to me. So super excited and love these ornaments, of course, too. I'm going to have a million. I'll have to have a tree that's mm -hmm. just cross-stitch ornaments. Yeah, that so was that nice. was my citrine nut call. Mm -hmm. How about you, friend? From... Oh, and then a million. Oh, wait a second. And of course... Oh. Of course. Of course. Fancy floss. Because I can never get enough of it. It just... Oh. Heavenly. Right. Heavenly. <laughs> love it all. Just and... buy the whole rack. Yeah, no, I, so the Stitchery Nook, yep. Lizzie Kate, a uh, little beach. Love this too. And it comes with the fabric and a little um, embellishment. And uh, Lizzie Kate oh, Seasons. This and this is, this is going to be fun. I'm looking forward to that. Mm -hmm. And I also found um, Heart and Hand Be Mine. From This Day Forward by Heart and Hand. Uh, French Country Wedding Cake by JBW Designs. <laughs> See the wedding theme. <laughs> There's a theme. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm really excited about this for our Stitch Mania. It's a JBW Designs Wreath Ornaments 2. Very Scandinavian, those uh, hearts. So I plan to do the hearts in red and white on a like a dark 
tan background. And then JBW Designs Seaside Alphabet. And there were a few, but the one I picked up is this one. And I think that's going to be fun to stitch. And then also Bent Creek, I Love You More. And that also comes with a button. So I'm excited mm -hmm. about that. I really am. Um, I'm just realizing I forgot a couple. Oh. Well, at least one. I, mean, I thought it was a couple, but maybe it's just this one. All that love made me realize. I was like, oh, I didn't show this one. Mm -hmm. I got I Love You More from Bent Creek also. And it has beads included. So, yeah. That's Super fun. cute. That is fun. Mm-hmm. And um, then <clears throat> we had gone on a previous trip, and I've looked all over my house, and I think I've already, like, dispersed everything. <laughs> you know, like, it's all been put away, but I... <laughs> You know, trying to keep it on the down low. <laughs> Keeping it on the down low. <laughs> but I did pick up earlier um, from a previous trip we had taken, um, Sweet Nothings, Happy Day by JBW Designs. And I might switch that into a wedding cake. And then also another pattern I plan to do for um, Stitch Mania, uh, Stockings Full of Love, of Joy, Joy and Noel. And that's the JBW designs as well. Except for I plan to put the cardinal on the top and make that an ornament. We are into cardinals. We are. We are into cardinals. As a matter of fact, there is a cardinal pattern. <laughs> that we're desperate to find. We are desperate to find. We have been looking. It's called Tis the Season. It's a blackbird design of a beautiful cardinal. And, it, and he's like dragging like holly. You know, it's really. <laughs> Love it, Holly. It came in a book. It came in yeah, a book. Yeah, the book was called Joy You Noel. Right. But we cannot find the book. We can't find the pattern. We know it's out of print. So if you can point mm -hmm. us in the right direction, if you've right. seen it, we would be so grateful because right. we are desperate to <laughs> we, stitch that. Just one more cardinal because you can't uh, get enough cardinals. You can't. <laughs> you can't. And my mom loves them too. So it's kind of fun to think about stitching mm -hmm. them for her too. So. Mm -hmm. Let us know if you can lead us in the right direction. In the right direction. <laughs> please, please, please. So, and I think that might... I've yeah, got some haul, more. I've got oh, some yep. haul from um, Fiberworks in Waverly when, when we, we were there. When we met with the gals. Mm -hmm. um, and then also I just found another one from Century <laughs> Nook. <laughs> and I was like, oh, sorry. <laughs> Looking a little disorganized today. Um, this one's called Bliss from Bent Creek. And I thought that was really sweet. Mm -hmm. So... I think that's all from <laughs> Stitchering Nook. Um, I found a couple of Rosewood Manor at Fiberworks that I thought were really beautiful. Mm -hmm. So this one's called My Token of Love. Mm -hmm. And I thought that was so pretty. I'm so attracted to red and white. I just think it's gorgeous. And then I also found Garden of Eden. And I just thought oh, that yeah, was really amazing. Mm -hmm. So beautiful. So, mm -hmm. and then I found this, this is a Midsummer Night Designs Blessings from Above. And I thought that was really, sorry for the glare, really sweet and could be personalized with our family name and with our family down here. I could just stitch my husband and myself and my son. So mm -hmm. I thought that was super cute. And then also this, um, this is an older Plum Street. It's called Stories oh, to Live by Jonah. I'm in love with that whale. Love it, love it, love it. So, mm -hmm. yeah. So those are some fun goodies from Fiberworks. I think there's more, but me too. I think I kind of yeah. dispersed it. Well, <clears throat> and that should be the last of our haul until like... Oh! <gasps> I forgot about Not this. <laughs> I was going to say it What is wrong with me today? Excuse oh me, friends. <laughs> I and got this. Here I was just saying we don't need any more haul runs for a while now. Right? Right. I am super thrilled that I picked this up prior to finding out about the Lizzie Kate announcement. Mm -hmm. I oh, I yes. got Things Unseen. This is the mystery right. sampler. This is what it looks like. Isn't Someone, this beautiful? Isn't it amazing? Someone had um, shared that, I think, on Stitch Mania. Right. Somewhere. 
um, on Facebook. I saw it and mm -hmm. did not know it was a Lizzie Kate. Mm -hmm. I hadn't seen it before and just was in love and had to have mm -hmm. it. So mine came with all three pet. Oh, I mean, you can imagine cost here. Whoa. <laughs> I know. I'm in this one to go I'm not kidding. My husband's going to kill me, you guys. But the colors are beautiful. Holy if cow. If you look at the floss colors and the buttons. Oh, my goodness. The colors are so just gorgeous. So pretty. Glare once more. Didn't take it all out. But gorgeous. The buttons are just beautiful. The colors. Oh, the mm -hmm. whole thing. I am in love. Mm -hmm. So I'm super thrilled that I was able to get my hands on this before right. the craze. Because I think we talked about this last night, too, that sometimes social media just gets people all right. wound up and in a panic. And we know there's a lot of folks that are in a panic. Well, about... this was a surprise. It was. It, was it's, it feels kind of sudden. Mm -hmm. So... I'm thankful that I got mm -hmm. this prior to the panic. Mm -hmm. So, yay! So, Can't wait to start that. I think okay. that might be it. Is that it? <laughs> oh my goodness. What are your plans? Oh, shoot. <laughs> I'm not... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we teach our kids at school how to goal set, which I think is amazing. Right. And I'm a super huge supporter of that. And yet, in my own life, I am not a good goal setter. I'll just admit it. I'm just laying it out there. I stink at that. I stink at making plans ahead of time. I just don't do well at that. So, um, or we just put too much on our plate. Yeah, well. right. It's just too much. It's just too much, and I get too overwhelmed, right. and I just can't cope with that. Right. Um. So my plans are just to keep trucking. Yeah. I'm <laughs> to just stitch what I want when I want to, and of course I want to stitch all the time. Right. The draw is always there. So I will stitch as much as I can and hopefully find some downtime. This is a super busy week again. I just feel like February is kind of nuts. I need it's, spring break mm -hmm. to get here. So a couple right. more weeks. A couple more weeks. We're, we're, we'll get there. Yeah. Yeah. And I am just going to finish the beach house by the end of the month. Mm -hmm. My first stitch along that I actually met the deadline. <laughs> That's the goal. Yay. And um, my daughter's wedding sampler as well as... I'm still looking for um, a way to finish the geranium house, if you remember that one. Uh, so I need to get that FFO'd, like, soon. <laughs> so, <laughs> and that's about it. Um, that's it. That's it. <laughs> Thank you so much for all of you who have given us a shout out. We're yes. so grateful. I know oh. we've had recent shout outs from Cowgirl Kate, mm -hmm. um, from Melly Ellie Stitches, from Night Owl Stitcher. Mm -hmm. um, who am I forgetting? I don't know. I'm sure if I'm we are, somebody. we apologize. I'm sorry, I hate <laughs> that. But we love you all. Right. Please know that that mm -hmm. even if we don't shout your name out right now, we love you. Right. <laughs> <laughs> we do. So. Um, yeah. In the meantime. In the meantime. Until we see you again. <laughs> remember. Wait, a little bit. Remember <laughs> to <laughs> shine, sparkle, sparkle and stitch. stitch. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Have a great week. Bye. Until next time.